Good morning, Viva. Bien, sir. Here's a breaking news. Yeah, Taiwan is pursuing independence incrementally, and those who support it all end up in self destruction. China's new defense minister, Wen Shandai, in a white ring speech at a security summit in Singapore, where the extent of regional tensions was on stark display. Minister of National Defense Admiral Dong Zun made the comments in a roughly 30 minute speech, which comes days after Beijing staged major military exercises and circling the island of Taiwan after it inaugurated its new democratically elected president last month. We will take resolute actions to curb Taiwan independence and make sure such a plot never succeeds, Dong said, speaking through a translator. While slamming external interfering forces for selling arms and having illegal official contacts with Taiwan. In an apparent reference to the United States, which maintains close unofficial ties with Taiwan, China says, committed to peaceful reunification. Yeah, but however, this project and the prospect is increasingly being eroded by. Separatists for Taiwan independence and foreign forces don't warn. His comments come as there has been high tint concern in the region over Beijing's military and economic intimidation of Taiwan, which has grown more pronounced under Chinese leader Xi Jinping. In a meeting with Dong on Friday, U.S. Defense Chief Lloyd Austin called on China not to use Taiwan's political transitions part of a normal. A routine democratic process as a pretext of coercive measures. China's ruling Communist Party claims the self governing democracy as its own, despite never having controlled it and has vote to reunite it with it too by force, if necessary. Taiwan's new president, Lai Ching Te, and his party, the Democratic Progressive Party DPP, are both openly. Lothed by Beijing for championing Taiwan's sovereignty. Lai has said he favors the current status quo, proclaiming that Taiwan is already an independent sovereign country, so there is no plan or need to declare independence. Yeah, the US also, by long standing policy, does not support Taiwan independence nor the unilateral change of the state's queue across the Taiwan Strait. The DPP authorities in Taiwan are pursuing separation in an incremental way. They are bent on erasing their Chinese identity of Taiwan and severing social, historical, and cultural links across the Taiwan Strait. Dong said, detrotting Beijing's rhetoric that they would be nailed to the pillar of same in history. Be in this exclusive report.